I like to start this cook off with inch thick top sirloin steaks and get it coated up on each side with Worcestershire sauce. This is gonna act as a binder for our sea salt mixture that we're gonna throw on these steaks. We're gonna coat our steaks with sea salt and garlic powder. I have them mixed together right here so it's easier. Once we get our steak coated in our sea salt and garlic powder mixture, then we're gonna move on to injecting it. I melted down regular butter, about a half a stick, and mixed it with garlic powder, and we're gonna inject this steak. After we get that steak injected, I like sticking in a temperature probe. This is gonna help us monitor it through our smoke. Once we get these steaks on the smoker, we're gonna take them to 115 degrees internal temperature, and then we're gonna pull them and let our smoker heat up to 500 so we can get that perfect sear on these steaks. It'll take our smoker a couple minutes to get up to temperature, so these steaks will just be resting for about five to 10 minutes. Before we put our steaks back on at 500 degrees, I like to coat them in a little bit of olive oil. This'll help so we get a nice sear on these steaks. Make sure to coat both sides. Once we got those steaks coated, we're gonna throw them back on the smoker for one to two minutes each side, rotating halfway through to get those perfect sear marks. Once you get the temperature and the sear marks you desire, your steak's ready to pull. Let it rest for about five minutes, then it's ready to enjoy.